Hello everybody, I'm back. That's right, this is Buffer Kid back again. I'm feeling a lot better now. I'm finally over that my nasty cold. I've had nasty cold for about for a full week. That really screwed me up. Screwed up my voice too. And it's just I'm I just there was nothing I could do. I couldn't make any videos because my voice wasn't right. And and I don't do anything when my voice is not right. So for that time, I spent most of the time watching some movies, checking on other people's videos. I was still on YouTube, but this is a video to let you know that I'm back, and I'm feeling a lot better. Okay, uh, first off, since this is back, this is a channel update for, for November 2nd, 2009. Yep, we are in November. And first off, I'd like to welcome two more new subscribers to Buffer K Productions. That puts me at 40. I am 10 away from 50. I need 10 more subscribers. So let's get me let's get me ten more subscribers. You know, I appreciate everybody for being patient with me while I was sick. And okay, so first off, uh, <clears throat> I'd like to welcome these two new subscribers, uh, the Super Diago and Italy Paul, who is also a new friend of mine. I'd like to th w welcome both of them and thank them for subscribing. Welcome to Buffer Kid Productions. Okay, and uh, also uh, let's see a friend here, a uh, new friend. PJ's Lincoln Park 217 217. He's a new friend too, along with Italy Paul. Great, you know, great here. Like I said, I like to have all the friends I can get, but like I said, I also like to have as many subscribers as I can get. Okay, and uh, let's see. Uh, while I was sick, I had checked out Random XB's channel. Uh, he had mentioned this this uh, this user here on YouTube. I checked out his channel. He just started a few week about a week or so ago. Uh, SNES Genesis Guy 14, uh, brand new channel. It's got like three videos up. Let's, you know, and I've noticed that you know uh, a lot of my subscribers, like uh, Five Four Twenty Nine, uh, Immortal Seven, Super Classics, have all subscribed to him. I've checked him out and I've subscribed to him. And uh, I'd like to say, go ahead and check out that channel. That's a great gaming channel. Okay. Um, uh, next thing, a uh, uh, new DVD purchase I've got. I uh, picked up uh, Star Trek II The Wrath of Khan here on DVD. This picked this up at Walmart for $13, uh, which was amazing. Was the sign back there, back in the uh, electronics section where they keep their DVDs at. It said $14.96, but when I took this up to the register, it ringed up as $13. I was like, eh, I ain't complaining. So, brand new DVD here. I'm going to watch this today. Eventually, I'll do a recommendation video for that. Uh, also, have a new Blu ray movie. Uh, I picked up Independence Day on Blu-ray. That was also on sale. Picked that up at Target for uh, $14. But I don't have that with me. Uh, uh, my brother is watching that right now. He has a PlayStation 3, so he's watching that because he wanted to see uh, Independence Day on Blu-ray. And so I'm letting him borrow it. Uh, great transfer rate on that, though. It, I had read one of the reviews. It said that the transfer rate to Blu-ray on Independence Day was not good. Bullshit. It looked good to me. Great movie, so pick that up on Blu-ray. Okay, uh, what next? Uh, oh yeah. Have you ever noticed, you know, lately how uh, flash memory has dropped in price? I can remember a year ago I picked up this uh, Mation flash drive here. This is a 1 gig uh, flash drive stick. I had to get this for one of my classes in college. Picked this up at, a campus bookstore, at the campus bookstore for $15. Yeah. Yep, needed this to save assignments, and then eventually I, uh, I would save some of my videos to it and transfer it to my laptop. Well, now this is just for saving files. Uh, picked up this HP about two weeks ago. This is a 4 gig HP uh, flash drive stick here. Uh, I use this uh, for, for transferring my MPEG-4 videos from my desktop because I don't want to fill up my hard drive on that. I tried it so I had to my laptop because I have an external hard drive as backup on my laptop. So that's where I save my videos. I also use this too for my Blu-ray player for the BD Live because my uh, Blu-ray player has an external U has a USB uh, extension port on the back and then I hook this in and I'm able to get on the BD Live. Okay, uh, uh, videos. Uh, definitely going to do my DVD recommendation video. So don't worry, I'm definitely going to do one of those since I'm feeling better. Uh, shout outs, I'd like to throw shout outs to Immortal7, congratulations on the 200 subscribers, great accomplishment. Uh, DVD Gamer, uh, Yeth Boss, uh, Scotty1992, 
and Cessna Ace, you know, thank you know, thank you for the message that you sent me uh, when I had emailed you to let you know I wasn't feeling good. Thanks everybody for your support and being patient with me while I was sick. So, but yep, I'm back now. I'll be making videos. So, okay, uh, I got a package coming in sometime this week. I don't know when it's going to be here. It's from Kansas City. It's an eBay purchase. So the minute that gets here, I will do an opening for you. You're definitely gonna love it. It's uh, it's gonna go into one of my one of my collections. So uh, when that gets here, I will show you. Okay. Uh, thanks everybody for watching. As always, you know I'll do my DVD recommendation video. And this is Buffer Kid saying, "Be cool and see ya." I'm back.